What's up, y'all? And I'm back with another motherfucking video. And in today's video, I got dumbass number one and dumbass number two. <laughs> so we got my best, my best friend right here, and we got my brother. Hey, shut up, bitch. We ain't saying nothing. I'm just playing. <laughs> so they gonna ask me ten questions each, and I basically have to answer them 100% honestly and truthfully. So honesty, honesty. <laughs> Whatever. I will. 100 percent it will be. So let's go ahead and get right into the video. So who wanna go first? I'm gonna start. I'm gonna take my shot now. Darius is the messy one, so should I start off first? If, no. so, yeah, I, I should start off first. <clears throat> Wait, yeah. I guess if I don't answer it, I'm gonna take a shot. Mm. Let's be fair. If I wanna answer it, I'm gonna take a shot. All right, the first question. If you had a chance to do anything different in 2021, what would it be? Say the question one more time. If you had a chance to do anything different in 2021, what would it be? Damn. Honestly, it'll probably be this apartment. It will, it will be this apartment. There's either any regrets in 2021, or let's say like giving somebody the wrong time. <laughs> in 2021? Mm -hmm. And if it's more than one, I want to see how many it is. <laughs> we just gotta take a shot for that <laughs> Damn. Mm, damn. You just gonna let that one off the whistle? <laughs> you talking about how many? So, can I answer half the question? No. Nah. Cool. You took a shot to it already. Took a shot to it already. 100%. Where would you want to be by the time you're 30? Damn. Yeah, it's hit me with these questions for real. 30, 30, 30. Like, what do you see as a door? I bet be big as fuck. If I'm not big as fuck, I bet be far as fuck with a job, a career, a path. By 30, I honestly should be, I better have some kids or a child. And I should be able, I should, I should have about two, three cars and probably own the house. Give or take. I get that. That's good. Yeah. 30, give or take. Add on with that. I don't see you with kids, but. Just uh, one, right? Just probably one. Probably, yeah. probably one. No animals. Just a body count. If not. Physical or oral? He said, if not physical or oral. I get my physical. Oh, oh, we good. Okay. <laughs> Let me see what I got. And we're trying to take no more shots. Shit, man. And we're trying to take no more shots. What did you expect to give to your supporters? <laughs> As in like, just generalizing it? Yeah, like what type of content do you Okay, that's what I was saying. Cause I was gonna say, I would love to start doing giveaways and shit. But as far as my content, once I figure myself completely out and get my path and my like, availability with my schedule together, I would love to get daily vlogs because my life is lit on a daily basis. No matter what, it's like you bitches. I'm just, I'm just very entertaining, and why not? So, daily vlogs, pranks, challenges. That's good. Welcome to the life of porn. Come figure me out. Subscribe. Go ahead, Aries. What would be some flaws in subscribing with you? Honestly, that's a good question. Some flaws in really? subscribing with me. Don't be in the comments. Y'all, like, I've been in on a couple other apps where they're in comments. Women, they like your ass, and they tend to talk shit. Bitch, I still will at you back. And I'll get the tweet in these motherfucking thumbs just like your ass do too. So basically, <laughs> don't take what you can't. You can't, you don't dish out, basically. But I love all my supporters. Honestly, I love truly all my supporters from Instagram, TikTok, Ego. Negative and positive. Negative and positive. 
Especially TikTok. I love all my niggas in the comments. I love you guys. I don't follow TikTok. I only man have TikTok. I, I should. Yeah, you definitely should. I should probably TikTok is lit. If you don't follow me, go ahead and stop what you're doing. Pause this video. Go on TikTok. Follow me at thereal.quan. I'm going to go ahead and put it right there. And come back to this video and hit subscribe and press play. Get right. All right. What are some things people always say about you? Honestly, like, I'm so sick of hearing that I'm rude. I'm stuck up. I ain't shit. I am shit. I hate you motherfuckers that come up with lies about me. Lies on who I'm dating, who I'm fucking, who I'm worried about. Why are you worried about me? I ain't worried about you. But like, what are some of the positive things people can always say about you? I don't find it. Ugh. You Other than appearance. Other than appearance, I have a head on my shoulder. Hmm. I'm very intelligent. I'm very bright. You can't play me. You can't have smart. You can't trick me. You can't treat me like shit. You just gotta love me because I love you back. Dilly with a Virgo. Comment below if you want to come a, a, a fucking discussion on Virgo because Virgos. Curious. I'm a Virgo and I know. And he swear he know the Virgo like the back of his tip of the brain. If you know something different, comment below. Because I don't think so. Virgos, they crazy. They good friends with bad relationships. Why do you feel like we're bad in a relationship? Not a bad relationship. Because I don't know. Oh, we got we gotta have this discussion. No, uh, we gonna we gonna save this for a whole I'm other video. Even, say we saving that for a whole other video. For Aries, y'all are bad for us. I don't think Aries and Virgos are meant for that. Aries are good people, but when you do something to an Aries, that's when they do something to you back. Well, Virgos, if you love an Aries and you down for an Aries one thousand, mm -hmm. they'll be down for you. But if you do something across them, of course they're gonna be like that. Like, it's, dealing like, with like what Virgo, reason did you do that for? Uh, dealing with a Virgo, it's always good intentions. Yes, always good intentions. I never heard of a Virgo crossing somebody or doing somebody. They have anything. good intentions, but they make it seem like the world is crashing down on them, mm -hmm. and they put you in the middle of it sometimes. Yeah, I'm not saying all Virgos are the same. But they yes. do have that. It that, depends that. on what type of bond you have with them, of course. Because right. definitely, if you're dating somebody, you I'm a, if this my world crisis, your world crisis too weird. Is one once you once we're dating, we're one. You can't unite as one, then we can't debate at all. Bye, get out of my life. Right. How she said, Bing bong, fuck your life. <laughs> he said it. <laughs> okay. Okay. Next question, Darius. It was your question, just I, I just added on. I just added on to it, but let me go on and see what I have over here. Do you think you're a person that does different things and meeting people? Like trying different ways? Or well, feel like you're the reason why something don't go as planned? I had many days where I thought I'd be the reason. Mm -hmm. And then I sit down and dwell on it. And it's not me sometimes because I'm going to give you what you're looking for as long as you give me what I'm looking for. Mm -hmm. So true. I would never say it's me overall because I have a lot of flaws. But I fix mm -hmm. it in ways that, that it, it wouldn't bother you to leave. Well, that's my next question. Now that we're right. You know what I'm saying to you. <laughs> Damn. What are some things you see in yourself as you're improving and maturing? My attitude. I need to get this attitude in there. You motherfuckers need to stop coming for me. And then I gotta stop coming for motherfuckers. I really gotta get my attitude together, but also, like, on some real shit. I gotta get my head together. Like, I'm going through a. COVID, I feel like COVID made me feel like I did a whole change in life. Man, COVID fucked. Man, COVID changed everything. So I got a different aspect of life right now. So it's like a, I got to give it my all and I got to just put my pride to the side for once. Good. Put your pride to the side. Mm. Bing bong. Fuck your life. Being what you already been through, or knowing what you already been through, what's some shit you do different in relationships and friendships, or anything that has a shift in me? I feel like in friendship, I, I'm in, in, in life right now. I feel like I'm watching who I give my my time and my love and my attention to, because that's all you can take and steal from me. Cause that shit, I don't know. At this point, can you ask that question again? Being what you already been through in friendships and relationships, what are some things you would do differently? What's some stuff you'll change if, if what you know now? 
Having a fun thing. Oh, um, you don't learn the game. You don't got the sauce. What's up? <laughs> as far as relationships, I'm gonna go into that. I'm gonna just say, as I'm elevating, it's only getting harder for you motherfuckers to come in and break break it down. I'm just letting you know that. So if you come to knock these walls down, you better come with a lot of power and a lot of shit to lay out on the table. Because one thing about me, I'm gonna lay everything. I'm gonna give you my all to lay out on the table. So I hope you can do the same thing. As far as friendships, it's all it's the same thing. It's just no love and int intimacy involved, honestly. Because I feel like I give my friendships the same thing I give my relationship. It's just no sex involved, no love like that. But watch the bitches as close as to you. Yeah. He, is lying. Lying. Close to he is not lying. That's the one that's gonna snake you first quarter. Most definitely. And yeah. as I'm better myself, it only comes with time and patience and learning yourself. I feel like as more time I give to myself, it's the only way I'm gonna better myself. That's the only time I can sit down and look at what I'm doing wrong with conversations with people. But like, but every every damn thing at this point. I feel like I'm not answering the questions answer. fully, no, but no, I'm that, trying. But that, that was, no, that was, that was good. I'm trying to break ice. I'm a little shy right phones, now. I don't know why. But I guess it's a sit-down conversation. I'm not holding the phone, vlogging me all together. Okay, so it's your question. You next. With 2022 coming up, we're like in the damn hour and 30 minutes. What's your New Year's resolution? That's some of the honest, that's an honest motherfucking answer. No shot to that one. Bitch, you gotta be real with yourself on this one. I just keep finishing my cup. Honestly, my New Year's resolution is to come the fuck hard for 2022. I'm gonna step on Thank you. you. Step on you bitches and harder than I was before. Step on you niggas and harder than I did before. That's you the fuck shit. Everybody that let me down in 2020, 2021, that brought me down for my joy, peace, and happiness, took from me, stole from me, robbed from me. Whatever you want to call it, snake me, diss me. I'm coming back, and I'm coming back ten times harder. And just know, if you thought you could touch me before, not physically, but just through the love and the kindness I provided, trust me, you ain't gonna ever touch me again. And half of the people that's gonna be watching this video, I. <laughs> All right, I'm being respectful. How do you like to be comforted when you're mad and upset? I don't know because I feel like to be comforted, I just need to be alone. Just let me go. My body is a boiling pot. No, you have water. to fix that because I said, how would you like to be comforted? How well, would you would like, like to, to be, be for that person to fix you when you're mad or upset? I guess just hold me and talk to me. Because my body's on fire. I'm on fumes right now. It's hard to calm me down. It's hard. It's good. Somebody call you flaw. Like, damn, that's a flaw in my book. I feel like somebody will call me flaw is because they see I have done so much for them, and the one time I honestly say no, they couldn't take it. And it was something they probably really needed me for, and it's just, I got tired of the, the shit. And I get tired of people's shit. Okay, that's for somebody that knows you. I'm talking about somebody that don't know you. Like, somebody that's outside. For me, an example. If you, if you outside and you don't know me and you call me flawed on the bitch, that's because you don't hit me up, I don't let your ass on red, or I don't say some shit and like them bitch pictures. Oh, I guess if you call me flawed because I left you on red, that's your, your lane. Or if you call me flawed because you heard something that switched the story up. I mean, I don't really be in much, so I don't know. Why would you call me flawed? That's a weird question to say, actually. To call me flawed? I don't do anything. I'm very genuine. So you reply back to message? You reply back in comments? Like what you mean? Like you 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 not flawed. Like I'm saying, if somebody hit you up in your DM or some shit like that. You always reply to your messages. Oh no, I'm gonna pay it. Oh, thank you. So you didn't word, word it like that, bro. I worded it in that way. Did he? I mean, I even did, word, but he said I, he asked why was I my comment flawed. Example, comment. You worded it right. I feel. Thank you. 
Whatever. Y'all feel like he didn't let us know. Right. Because I, I thought I you said, you why would you? Or what, what I wanted back in the DMs. I said, Your last or whatever. and final question. My last and final question. For both of y'all, just for me. Both. This is, this okay, is, is, first. Yeah, both. I know. Yeah. I do you have one more question? Mm hmm. Yeah. Last and final question. Yeah. What do you expect out of your next relationship? Like, what do you expect out of that person? <laughs> the world on that. Honest, like, love, honesty. It's, I love, honesty, attention. And I don't know. That's about it. It's not much. I don't really need nothing else. Full love, honest, love, attention, full undivided. Yeah, but you're right. making it easy. Like anybody would say that. Like, what do you expect? Okay, I can't that bring all that person. down. Mm -hmm. I can't, I'm not gonna bring That's all why that down. I said too much. The world and that. Exactly. <laughs> love, be loyal, be okay. loving, be caring, be honest, be truthful. Be all that and above. Come with your own car. Come with your own money. <laughs> and that's about it. How easy can that get? This ain't church, so don't come as you are. No, this ain't church, so don't come as you are. I need you to come with a little bit. <laughs> and this video is not sponsored by the Chips juice. juice. What they call I that? I was supposed to show it. Commission? What they call that? Chips and juice. No. <laughs> I don't even know. All right? Come come on. On. Let me know. I, 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 okay, what's your last final question? That was it. Yeah, he didn't have a last one. I was the last final question. Right? All right. So this is about to wrap up this video. Don't forget to go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe. You can go ahead and follow his Instagram if you want to like. Combo underscore Pat 20. And his Instagram. Get right underscore Dave. It's too bad. But yeah, you had to think about it. Real tired. Go ahead and follow me. Y'all know see, in the description below. In them. Count. Come on, bro. And we're about to go ahead and do a who knows me better challenge versus him or him. I have the questions available. So I'm if you want to see that now. video, go ahead and click next. And I'll see you in the next I video.